Well, come back. He might be a ghost, but does that mean he can breathe underwater? Probably. Let's go. SpongeBob World. Bikini Bottom? Nope. SpongeBob World. Who decided to call it those? Oh, we actually can't. <laughs> Strapped in a tree? What? Who writes this? Like, I, I, I know it's just some licensed schlock on the gameplay, but, like. That. That's our excuse for not being able to play as Spongebob? That's that's how he was like captured and whatnot? He got stuck in a tree? Take pictures till the fire department knows where he is? What in the heck is this? Jellyfishing? No, I did enough jellyfishing way back in Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. Don't you dare tell me to catch jellyfish. Oh. oh, yeah, I figured we are going to have the gum. They are really milking the, <laughs> that one concept from the show. It makes sense, at least. Photograph sponge off a tree limb. Look, see, I think the most ridiculous thing about this is that I don't think SpongeBob would be the character to get stuck in a tree. On the other hand, since he's in frame right now, Patrick, if you told me Patrick got stuck in a tree and we had to get the fire department to save him, I would believe that wholeheartedly. SpongeBob though? Or maybe even SpongeBob and Patrick together because Patrick's dumbness kind of seems to rub off on SpongeBob. I think Patrick like swallowed an orb of confusion when he was a child or something, I don't know. But, SpongeBob in isolation, really? Or if, like, Spongebob... See, see, this could also work. Like, this seems like something that would be a scene in the show. Garrett gets stuck in a tree. Spongebob climbs up to help get him down. He realizes he's afraid of heights, and now he's stuck in the tree. That one makes sense. As well. But Spongebob just got... stuck in a tree. Like, we have the technology to cross universes and to breathe underwater, but we can't get a sponge out of a tree. Bye, Jimmy. Oh, there's SpongeBob. Hey, SpongeBob, get back here! Don't you lie to me! You're not stuck in a tree. Wait, now you're just in bed. This is all just a sham. I'm not sure I like this rendition of the title team. Anyways, I feel a little bit lied to. Daniel was in ghost form when he... Did Daniel always have a... Is he wearing a belt? Did he always have a belt like that? I haven't seen much of Danny in not ghost form. Where did Gary just come from? Just... just keeps happening? What are you saying, SpongeBob? You have fun on that tree later. Back here? That's older Angelica, too. That's interesting. Hey, you're that guy whose name I don't know at all. <laughs> Hi, Scooper. <laughs> I appreciate that everyone else conveniently managed to get it. Hi, Nigel. Just conveniently managed to get little air bubbles. Why don't I get one of those? Ability? Nothing. You just have to build that up, I guess, over time. Nice squid. That's a very happy looking squid on the right. Oh. Tan Squidward too, apparently. Yeah, it's also strangely happy to see me. Oh, he did get stuck in the, in the tree this month with, um... I can't take a picture of it. Oh! There we go. Did we know he would get stuck in a tree, or was the other SpongeBob just an imposter? I, that never occurred to me. You can actually. I know you can jump. <laughs> Look at that jump animation. <laughs> ah. I don't think you guys usually swim like that, but okay. Can't get away. 
Oh man. There we go. What's Mark Roy doing? Oh, get away from that pencil. No. Oh jeez. That'd be weird if I was playing as auto now. I don't think Patrick's actually... Oh, hello. Cool. <laughs> well, these characters can keep ending up in all sorts of different worlds. Puff! Puff, you weren't driving on the road. It's kind of concerning. Isn't there? Is it? Okay, I thought the door was photographable. Apparently not. I wish I kind of embarrassed him that I don't know most of these characters' names. Like even lots well, of them I even recognize. Helga, what was that the one I just saw? Why is it shit flying around everywhere? Janae! Why and how is there a Apparently it's just a SpongeBob thing. There was being a plane. Actually, I guess planes are a thing in the SpongeBob universe, aren't they? <laughs> What's Chester doing here? I don't recognize that picture of him. Hi, Vicky. <laughs> well, we saved her. Okay. I don't know how long she was sitting there, but... No! I don't want to go. Oh, Tommy. Grown Tommy. Player has gone over 40%? Oh, I guess, um... Percentage of things photographed. I wonder if I have to redo levels to, to complete my album. I'm kind of... I've, I kind of want to complete my album now, though. I hope it's organized in a way that makes it easy to... To know which level you miss things in. What robot imposters? I guess there's the robot Eddie, but... Quadruple exclamation mark. We owe it to Danny to know how to take photos of things. You know, I could totally see Danny, like, just legitimately, secretly being really good at photos or something. Or just liking taking pictures. I don't know why I think that. I think part of it is that Danny, outside of the ghost thing, actually, the, more than any other character, seems like a normal person. That you could just imagine having a hobby like that. Like, he feels the least cartoonish out of these characters. Um, I mean, in this game, though, there are probably other characters that are even less cartoonish, like Tommy, older Tommy, that is. And he, I, I never watched All Grown Up, really, myself, but he's, I, he's just a dude, as far as I'm aware. <laughs> he's just a guy. Although, I think one of the things that people were confused by with the show All Grown Up was that the whole premise of Rugrats was that they were babies, and then... And all grown up, they they just weren't anymore. So like, what's the? It, it, I guess it was like kind of almost just a sitcom, but with people, or both cartoons, or almost. I don't know. I never got drawn to it, so whatever. I never watched Rugrats religiously in the first place either. So, although I did watch some of it. I mean, there are probably lots of. If someone's digging through the dumpster with the crust of crab, it's probably crabs. I don't like you use the word blast, Jimmy. Only two. Trash cans, sure. Do I have to play all these objectives to win? Why does Jimmy come in as a ghost? Jimmy. Why does Jimmy come in as a ghost and then not leave as a ghost? Oh, you're not looking for the... Not digging through the trash yet? If you say so. Person. Oh. You're not a person. Sorry, Squidward. You've been demoted. Robocrabs! That's the robot! I blanked in. I can't see Robocrabs without thinking of, uh... Operation Krabby Patty. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. That is some memories. That game's never gonna stop being so strange and hilarious to me. Hey, 
Hey, if anyone's gonna be able to do a boss battle though with a camera, it's gonna be Danny. I don't know why he couldn't just like run up and punch whoever it is that he's basing off against, but maybe it's just to prove that he can use a camera. I don't know. What are you doing there? What? Where did the other patty from? I don't think these footers are going to be very good if they're through, through a wall. Unfortunately, running doesn't mean you can actually advance the, the game faster. Oh, it's that guy. Oh, he didn't actually throw it in a trash can this time. That's different. Cool. Oh, there's a trash can. Aha! Oh, and there is in fact Scooper digging out of it. Very nice. But he, is, he, is he gonna be the one digging from a dumpster? Why is this guy green? It seems like lots of things here are references to like individual gags from the show, which is nice. They actually, this shows a lot of actual research from or on the source material, which I like. I mean, see, you have little things like that's just a reference to a single shot from the show. Leave you alone, crabs. Whatever's going on is apparently something fairly notable. Interesting cutaway there. Against the wall. That's a thick wall. Flip! Keep flipping, boy. Flip. Oh, hey. <laughs> in this game, the exit signs are as one finds in North America. And, like, in, uh. What was it? What are you doing? Ah, sorry, SpongeBob. That was mean. Like a yellow avenger. Oh, goodbye. I don't think you can roll very well in sand. In fact, that reminds me. Do you have underground too? In fact, we're, well, you could glitch the game, but in Australia you would were not normally allowed to skate on the beach. Although I don't know if that was so much because you weren't capable of doing so, or because there was a rule. So to speak, like in university, you weren't allowed to do so. What are you doing here? I already got a picture of you. Does it tell us if we already got these objectives? Yeah. Yeah, we've done everything. So you just get pictures of our characters. Or you can take pictures while running. Interesting. Why is Plankton wearing? Well, he's wearing whatever he wears while he's inside of the. Weird little bouncy damage thing came and nothing happened. He's wearing what he wears inside of the robot, I guess. So that's really the whole excuse. The the fact there is there there is one short scene where SpongeBob was stuck in a tree, and for that reason, I couldn't play a SpongeBob for this whole world. Okay, I guess you can't play as somebody in their own world. It turns out it actually was SpongeBob that was stuck in a tree with Gary. See, that makes sense. That's not how they phrased it, though. But we apparently just knew Spongebob would be up there, unless these are clones that we found, aside from that one. Well, that, that's everywhere in Bikini Model. Okay. Won't have a lot of time until what? Whatever. I think your music reminds me, for some reason, of the music in... Hot Wheels burning rubber. I know, man. Okay. I guess you see it's the robot that's making people go wherever. Or making people come from one universe to another. Unless you offer to be caught up in this, anyways. Jeez! Okay, well, bye everyone. Not really a good time to... There's not a good moment to cut the episode other than just pausing here. Bye everyone.